Are you struggling to convert millimeters to millimeters cubed? Do not worry, this is one of the most common mistakes in GCSE physics. I'm going to show you a very important trick. The thing to remember is that centi actually stands for a mathematical power, which is 10 raised to the minus two, and milli, as in millimeter, stands for a mathematical power, which is 10 to the power of minus three. Now, if we were to convert five centimeters squared, all we need to do is remember that this square acts on both the centi and the meter, so this will actually be equal to five times 10 to the power of minus two meters squared, which is of course just equal to five times 10 to the power of minus two times two will give us minus four meters squared. If we had five millimeters squared, all we need to do is remember that the square acts on both. Now, milli is 10 to the power of minus three, so this here will be five times 10 to the power of minus three meters squared, which will be equal to five times 10 to the power of minus six meters squared. For another very common mistake in GCSE physics, you absolutely need to have a look at this video right over here because you might be making that mistake and hurting your understanding of physics. 